Like much of the Bahamas residents on Abaco Central and South Abaco, rejected the four gender equality bills. Cleopatra Murphy has the local reaction tonight. Question number one, no. Number two, no. Number three, no. Number four, no. It took officials about three hours to count the results of the gender equality referendum Tuesday night. And on Wednesday, they were back at it again for the recount at the government complex in Marsh Harbor, Abaco. Aside from Bill 1, which received 737 yes votes to 591 noes, others were rejected in Central and South Abaco. Bill 4 received 460 yes votes and 856 noes. Resident Livingston Miller voted yes on 3, but no to 4. He also believes the controversial Bill 4 led to the public rejecting all of the bills. The Bahamians are, uh, how, how can I say it? We are kind of, we are very peculiar people and, and you know, a lot of us for some reason, like when we have friends and, and when, once it, the talking is out, in a sense, a lot of people voted, but most of their friends. So people went into the, to the booth with their mind already made up. Voter Decree Sands was pleased with the results. We are the people, we make the government, and they kind of push things down our throat, and we have to deal with it. So I'm happy that everybody voted. Resident Brooke Pierce Reckley, who voted at St. Francis de Sales Catholic School, had hoped for a different result, knowing the challenges she faces as a child born to a Bahamian mother and American father. Me being Bahamian, my mother being Bahamian, we really don't have any rights per se. If I wanted to leave this country, as a Bahamian, excuse me, as a foreigner with a Bahamian husband, I technically cannot take my child with without the permission of him. Central Abaco Administrator Charles Moss says he expected a tighter margin but believes results were impacted by Bill 4. I believe that persons who, who felt some kind of way about Bill number 4, I think they married that to um, certain other bills, and I think, well, I feel that perhaps maybe that's, that's the reason why. But um, the results were, were shocking, actually. Moss says voter turnout was low, with a little more than 1,300 of approximately 3,000 registered voters voting. He says as polls were about to close, more people rushed in to vote. Cleopatra Murphy, ZNS Network News.